Hey, this demo will go over the concepts of signal to noise ratio and comparing a magnetic receive only loop antenna and a full size uh, HF antenna. So what is signal to noise ratio? Right now this is a good example of a high signal to noise ratio. The station's a lot stronger than the surrounding uh, the surrounding the background noise that we're seeing. So he's clear, you can understand you can understand what he's doing. But you can also hear a lot of background noise. And we can't hear any of the other stations uh, trying to check in. So magnetic loops work on the basis of the magnetic part of the radio frequency spectrum. So when you send when you transmit your signal it has two components, a voltage component and a magnetic component. RFI also has uh, a voltage component, mostly a voltage component and not so much a magnetic component. And no one seems to understand why, but it does. It's also always vertically polarized. So using a loop, a receive only loop that only works on the magnetic portion of it of the spectrum that's horizontally polarized helps reduce all kinds of noise and we'll demonstrate this here right now okay mike i had the wrong receiver on i got pqm in glendale oregon but but i didn't get the uh, the prefix one more time please mike Okay, got it. Thank you very much. I just filled it in. I'm, I'm listening several different ways. I'm lis listening on two SDRs and on my regular radio here, and different people come in strong on different ones. And a lot so of you can hear uh, the it signal, the night. overall signal strength uh, has kind of dropped in the waterfall, the Public Service system, looking for which is okay calls, because the signal to noise ratio up. actually improved. You can hear a lot less background noise. And there's a station near the noise. Uh, Gary, there was somebody in there, but what did you say? Yeah. I heard Sherman. I don't know if Dave got him, but I'll write him down on my later because I did hear time him. Time this here. Roger, roger. Oh. Scary. Uh, there may have been a station trying to check in to the Western Public Service System. Come now. Okay, I don't hear anybody. K6 PQM, did you hear him? I'll try that again, uh, 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 Mike. Hey, give it to me again and I'll write it down. Yeah, we're just not able to hear the other station. So this is the concept of signal to noise ratio. Can you confirm with him, please? And having a receive only loop antenna really combats local noise. And the other benefit is if you can put your receive only loop on a rotator, you can rotate the loop around and actually null things out. Uh, some of the RFI I receive is from my neighbor's house. So I point it broadside to my parents' now. So let's see if we can null the station out. Come on. Uh, were those stations trying to check in? Come one more time. Yeah, he might be very local to me, and I might not be able to. I have now Whiskey 7 Mike Alpha Bravo. Is that correct? Okay, it is a very rough call. But okay, I so we were, I was Thank able to rotate that. the antenna yeah, around later, to weaken to his signal. And a mag loop has the ability, or 
by its design, has very deep nulls in 90 degrees of the plane of the loop. And there you have it, signal to noise ratio and the benefits of having a receive only loop to combat radio frequency interference and improve your listening pleasure.